In Birdville ISD, we are on a journey of continuous improvement. So why continuous improvement? This year, we've talked a lot about Urban Meyer's book, Above the Line, where he says the constant pursuit of knowledge and improvement, striving to make yourself better today than you were yesterday, is not merely an indispensable tenet for leaders to follow, but one of the great joys of life. This is the thinking of continuous improvement. And so what we'll talk about more throughout this course is how we put that into a process and a structure. So it goes beyond just a way of thinking to a way of doing. So why CI? It's a mindset. It's a practice use of strategies to help build a growth mindset among your students, you as teachers, and the whole staff. It's a way to build relationships with all of your stakeholders. When we create and use systems that align our curriculum, instructional delivery, and assessment to the learning requirements, and we consistently monitor progress toward agreed upon academic goals, and adjust accordingly to meet student needs, then we eliminate guesswork involved when predicting performance on high stakes assessment. When we look back, we can learn from what has happened and it will enable us to move forward and that's what continuous improvement is all about. It helps us look at where we have been, where we're now, and where we are going. So we have these variable inputs that come into our work every single day and through a process of continuous improvement and using strategies such as PDSA, we can lead ourselves to predictable quality outputs. This gives us a system of responsive processes all about producing the high quality outputs, which for us is all about high quality student learning.